having an amazing Monday. Uh, yes, today's Monday. I work three days, then I get a day off. Yay! Which is a good thing. Um, we are going to work Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And then Thursday is 4th of July, and Thursday's a holiday. So we don't have to work on Thursday. Unless you're scheduled to work, but we're not scheduled to work. We're off that day. So thank God we're off that day because I love having a day off during the week. I love it. Anyways, um, still haven't cut our grass. The grass is like to my, some parts are to my waist, some parts are to my knees. Yeah. But, I mean, we don't have a lawnmower and we don't have a weed eater. Well, we have a weed eater, but my husband cut, like, the wrong piece to make it work. Hopefully nobody comes by and says, hey, your grass is still long. Um, we need you to do something about it. Hopefully they don't do that. And we need to do it before they come and say, oh, well, we're going to find you for your grass being so long, you know? Hopefully, we get it taken care of before that happens. But, anyways, looks like it's going to be a pretty day. The sun's shining through these clouds real pretty. I was thinking about stopping right here at the store, but I don't know. Kind of crunch time right now because I usually eat leave earlier than this. Oh, and the other day, y'all know I told y'all about if you go to this store, 7-Eleven, and if you download the app, you get points. Well, I went to the store the other day. Well, I have been going to the store every day. I went Monday through Friday, and I got me a drink. And one day I got something else, another day I got something else. Anyways, Friday when I stopped there I got what I had to get and then when I was leaving my phone goes off and I'm looking at it and I didn't even get to see what it said but it gave me 5,000 points I was like what the freak that's a lot of points so if y'all haven't downloaded the app for 7-eleven do it y'all get points y'all get free food y'all get a lot of free stuff so guys, I went inside the store to ask the lady if they were like doing a promotion on the points or if they were doing anything like to where you get a lot of points. And the lady was like, well, you must have bought something that that uh, gave you a lot of points. And I was like, why well, do I remember what I bought that it would have gave me a lot of points? And I'm thinking about it. Friday, Friday, I only bought a refill and a little taquito, but I think I had got an email saying that they were tripling your points for the week or something like that, um, if you went so many times uh, during the week, so maybe that's what it was, I don't know, I guess we'll see. I'm going to look through my emails and see if I can find anything uh, about it that says anything about it. But I don't remember anything about that. But we'll find out. We will find out. One way or another, we're going to find out. But anyways, um, so I'm on my way to work. And I hope today goes by fast. I just, you know... You're, you know, when you're in that one kind of mood, or like, you don't even want to be at work. You just feel, like, crappy. You just want to be like, uh, you know. You just want to be in bed. Like, Saturday night, I only slept, like, maybe two hours max. That was it. About two hours. I woke up about eight or nine. I went to H-E-B and I bought a few things and I went to go get my husband a taco 
and came home and then I was cleaning I was washing clothes you know I was doing a lot of stuff and uh, didn't take a nap didn't go lay down you know I was just on the go last night since I didn't get that much sleep the night before last night I laid down and I couldn't go to sleep I could not go to sleep I was wide awake I was watching this show and I was just like all into this show and I couldn't go to sleep for nothing I don't know what the deal was finally I went to sleep about 12 o'clock and uh, slept till about like 2 30 and then fell back to sleep woke up about 3 3 something and fell back to sleep and then finally it was 5 o'clock I've been getting up at 5 o'clock lately and I haven't like literally got up I lay there for a minute because I can't just jump out of bed because of my back so I been putting my alarm at 5 so that'll give me a little bit of time where I can like take my time getting up because if I get up just jump out of bed <laughs> I would be so bad like I would be hurting so bad like yesterday I got up from the bed I mean I took my time and everything and I was okay and I went to the store and I was getting a few things and when I was standing in line to check out I was getting severe back pains like I couldn't even stand up I had to lean over on the you know where you put your food on the little belt thing I had to literally lean over just to take pressure off my back like right now I'm sitting in the car and I'm having like real bad sharp pains on my lower back right now like bad pains I do not know why Um, I don't know why I'm getting pain. I don't know why I'm getting pains in my back. I mean, I've never gotten pains when I'm sitting in the car, you know, going to work. And I'm hurting right now, like, big time. Um, but, I mean, I gotta do what I gotta do, you know what I mean? But, I'm in severe pain right now. Like, severe pain. Hopefully it starts like going away a little bit whenever I get to work. And when I start moving around, usually it stops hurting. Like the pain starts like going away a little bit, but not as much. Um, like it's not there, like in full force, like it is right now, like how I, how it's feeling right now. But I. Uh, But throughout the day, it usually just, like, starts going away little by little. But not a, it's not as bad as it is, you know, when I get up in the morning. So, hopefully, it starts going away a little bit. Um, sometimes I feel like the medicine that I get, it's not, like, some days it feels like it's not strong enough. And I'm in so much pain. And then there's some days where I'm fine and everything's good. And like, I don't know, it's just, it, it, some days it's just worse than other days. Like right now, it's worse than what any other day is. But this is the second day that it's hurt like this. Because yesterday it hurt, um, It hurt so bad. Yesterday it hurt so bad. Today it hurts again. So I don't know if this is a pattern of my back hurting. Or if it's just like. I don't know. I don't know. Because it. Usually after a day it will start going away. And then I'm fine. I mean the pain's there but not as bad. But like the pain is just there right now. It's just there. So. Hopefully, it's not nothing bad. Hopefully, 
hopefully everything's okay. I'm just praying everything's okay. But that being said, um, before we get any further into this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if y'all haven't already. Hit that little bell to get notified whenever I post a video. Share, share, share everywhere. I did want to tell you another thing. I've been using the fix it -Em for the top and the bottom. Um, but I've been having problems with, like, right here. I, it feels like my gum, like, this, this inside of my cheek, like, it goes inside my denture. And it pinches it. In which, whenever I put my denture on, I try to make sure that the inside doesn't go inside my denture. Like, the inside skin. And sometimes it just happens and um, whenever I try taking off my denture it pulls so hard on the inside right here it hurts so bad guys I feel like I'm in, in severe pain like seriously um, just wish that I wouldn't have that pain right there um, I don't know why it's like that I mean I know my cheeks on the inside my cheeks are a little big. I know that. Uh, I know on the inside I have a little bit of extra skin in there. For me, uh, being so overweight and then losing all the weight. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like that, guys. I don't like that at all. Don't like the feeling. I don't like knowing I have all this extra skin. I, I hate it. I hate it, guys. I'm just... frustrated with my body right now I look at it and like ugh, like that I just look at my body and I'm just like ugh. my body is just uh, uh. yeah um, anyways I don't know how we got to that <laughs> I guess talking about Anyways, so I, I haven't redid the top reline. Um, I probably will do it this weekend or maybe Wednesday, uh, Thursday that we have a day off. But um, I'm gonna see how I'm gonna wait as long as I can just to do the reline. Uh, hopefully, I can wait as long as I can. But every time I try taking it off on this side, I can feel like the reline sticking to my gum and I literally have to go in there and pop it off uh, just so it won't come off of my denture so yeah it probably won't be that much longer that I need to do a new reline but I'm just trying to hold off as long as I can today's been one of them days as you can see I'm out here walking my hair just turned to crap because of the wind and uh yeah i wanted to come on here i'm having an anxiety attack i've been having it all day long i can't breathe i can't catch my breath i feel like somebody's squeezing my chest where i cannot take a deep breath i feel like somebody is taking my breath away from me if that makes any sense um i just i don't know what's wrong with me and i haven't went to the doctor i know that guys i know it i i know but i need to make an appointment for the anxiety because guys me not being able to breathe like i i breathe right now it's like or like the way i'm breathing right now it's like i can't take a deep breath and i feel like i'm gonna fall out i feel like like I've been running like it feels like I've been running and running and I haven't um, I was sitting at my desk and I uh, was doing my work and I was doing fine and then all of a sudden I felt like I couldn't take a deep breath I felt like I was gonna fall out I felt like I don't know it felt like somebody was just squeezing the lights out of me you know what I mean like I couldn't take a deep breath um, I felt like, like I was going to pass out, literally, like somebody was 
just like holding my breath or something. That's what it felt like. It feels so weird, guys. Like, you wouldn't believe. I just felt so uncomfortable. I had to get out of my office. I had to come out here and take a walk because uh, I just trying to get, you know, like my breath back or trying to feel like I uh, can breathe again or that's what it feels like. I don't know. Sorry about the wind. But I was trying to, like, start breathing right but I don't know it's just weird there is a truck that's leaving right there there was another one here just a while ago and I was walking out here so I can come and uh, do uh, get something from my car and uh, I saw that car the first truck out here there was safety people okay that safety person came through here and then now this safety person came through here okay so why the fuck are they coming through here excuse my language again uh i don't understand why they're just rolling through here there's nobody doing nothing out here nobody's doing nothing at all it's a break time so i mean people can walk around our building and stuff and not have no problems but i guess maybe they think it's too hot for people to be walking i don't know but I'm wearing a jacket and I'm still walking. Look at this. Yeah. This is my outfit of the day. Yeah. And it's hot. So, it's not hot to me. It's windy, so it feels good. But anyways, guys, just wanted to give you all that little update. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and end my video right here. I hope everybody had a good morning, good night, good evening, or whatever else it is at the time you're watching this. I hope you're having an awesome one. And until my next video, bye-bye.